check it out. I got a server existing reliably outside on solar mining crypto. Responsibility is the name of the game cracker killer. You need to get yourself a job. So yeah, today I got uh, three laptops and a server running, all running crypto, running Varus Miner. And it's hard to see when the sun's up as high as it is. This is an Asus, man, this is just a throwaway I scavenged. And this one is a ThinkPad T14 i7, 10th generation. This one is a i7 5th gen or 6th generation. Did you guys hear that? That was a kill deer. That's a bird that lays down and acts like it has a broken wing so you'll piss off. I thought that was my uh, inverter saying that the batteries were getting low. <laughs> sorry about that. Anyways, so right here, uh, sorry, this one's running World Community Grid. I'm not mining on that thing. I'm still doing God's work over here. Or the, f f or the very past safari and flying spaghetti monsters work. Right now I have three inverters. I got the 100 watt going directly to the server, uh, the 500 watts going to the ASUS, and the 300 watt is on the T14 Lenovo, and this unit took directly up to DC. So what's really fascinating is most computers actually work on DC, and if you can just push it direct DC, then hey, that's okay with me. Stepping hardware up from 12 volt, which is a car generally. This particular car actually probably had a six volt, but that was way back in the day. Cars these days, car batteries are 12 volt. Uh, same with RVs. And if you're stepping into an RV, that's what you gotta know. Now, consumer electronics are five volt and uh, household electronics are generally uh, 110. I'm pretty sure most or if not all dryers operate off of like 210. I don't think I've ever had a computer to take 210. Like, uh, otherwise you're going to dent it. But I think I could get you another one up there if you wanted one. That'd be sweet. Definitely don't want to dent anything. If you wire it up, that all I have to do is pass a wire down to you. Would we you can... like me to take that panel and when I go up, take it up? Yes. Hopefully tomorrow I get rid of the black <laughs> It can be kind of surprising how much energy you save if you close these things up, if you keep the monitors off. And then it's also good just to keep the sun off of them, just to keep them less than super warm. I'm sure y'all rich city folk have interesting ways to keep uh, the sun off y'all laptops outdoors, but around you here we all like to use the power of mirrors. Wonderful for scaring away vampires. And bending and manipulating the sun to do what you wanted to. Mwah, ah, ah, ah. Have a good one, folks. Take care of each other.